Talking about your forecast, we're looking live at radar potential tropical cyclone HUC moving towards the area. Meteorologist April Loveland is tracking its path and how it's going to impact all of us. Hello and thank you so much for joining us this afternoon. I am Erin Miller. You saw it just a moment ago there on radar. There could be a whole lot of rain in store for us and we want to make sure that you are prepared this week. Let's bring in meteorologist April Loveland tracking it all for us this afternoon. April, you and I were just talking about how gross it is out there already. Oh, I know we hate to see it on a Monday, but yeah, that's what we have to deal with. Lots of cloud cover. We're seeing some kind of mist drizzle going on out there right now. We are continuing to track potential tropical cyclone eight out there going to be bringing us the potential for some heavy rainfall and some severe weather as we head through later tonight. Now, most of the day today, we're just going to be dealing with some sprinkles and lots of cloud cover and wind. That's the current radar right there. As we look at the current track right now, you can see it is going to be staying a tropical cyclone. We're not really expecting it to strengthen at all. It's actually going to continue to weaken there. Winds at 50, gusting up to 65, moving to the north northwest at five miles per hour. So what are we expecting as we head through the day today? Well, you see really through this evening, it's not looking too bad. Just some sprinkles out there, the wind, the mist. By uh, this evening, we are tracking more rain moving in and those bands are going to be uh, becoming heavier as we head through early Tuesday morning. So that's kind of the bullseye for when we could potentially see that severe weather. And you'll notice coastal Carolina there is under a level two threat for some scattered severe storms. The rest of North Carolina under a level one. So here's what we can expect. Damaging winds and also tornado formation is higher on the scale there along with flooding potential. So we've got a lot to keep an eye on as we head through this evening. So this afternoon, showers and wind, soggy and windy start for your Tuesday morning. And then we're looking at rains, rain and more storms as we head into Tuesday afternoon. So we've got a lot to talk about coming up in my first warning seven day forecast.